<laughs> now calm down, Odie. It's just a little shot. <laughs> What's the matter? Afraid of a shot, scaredy pup? Show a little bravery, why don't you? All done. <laughs> See? Now that wasn't so bad. But he was so terrified, so frightened. What a big baby. Say, while Garfield's here, we might as well give him his shot. Well, now there's a good idea. Save a trip back here, just give me my sh 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 What is that ghastly noise? All done. Get me an attorney. Get me an attorney named Murray. Call the Society for the Prevention of Cruelty to me. Call. All done? Huh? That wasn't so bad. Huh? Excuse me, who is the veterinarian? I am. How can I help you? Oh, well, you can't help me. <laughs> I'm Mrs. Van Gelt, and I'm so frightfully rich I don't need any help. But you can help poor Prince Orloff here. Hello, Prince Orloff. What seems to be wrong with him? He coughed. Twice, I'm afraid. Quick, get an ambulance. <laughs> <laughs> Prince Orloff's regular physician is away. I'm counting on you to cure my precious widow baby dumpling. Uh, Mrs. Van Gelt, I can already tell there's nothing wrong with your precious widow baby dumpling, except he needs to exercise. What? This is my cat Garfield. <laughs> he doesn't just sit around the house all day. He tries to. Well, I wouldn't want any cat of mine to turn out like... Like that. A cat needs to run and play. I'll have you know Prince Orloff's delicate paws do not touch ground. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe it's time they did. Well, I can see you're not the proper physician for Prince Orloff. Come, dolls. Let us take Prince Orloff home and put him to bed. Yes, madam. Can you imagine a cat living like that? Being carried everywhere and waited on all the time? Yeah, I'm working on it. Oh, I think I need to get home. Is Prince Orloff comfortable, Dawes? I placed him gently on the rear seat. Oh! I'm... I'm standing! I'm not on one of those silly pillows. And now... Oh, look at me, I'm walking. I am, I'm walking. Oh, mother, if only you could see me. I'm actually doing something for myself. You know, Oster, it sure would be great to have a life like that. Servants waiting on you, bringing you food whenever you're hungry. Here's your lunch, Garfield. Oh, and I washed and fluffed the cushions in your bed. Yeah, wouldn't it be nice to have someone wait on you all the time? No! It's awful! Oh, you feel so helpless, always dependent on someone else. What are you doing off your pillow? I couldn't take any more of being waited on like that. I don't ever want to live in a mansion again. Although, I am kind of hungry. Where do they feed you there? Well, last night we had lobster thermidor au crevette with a Mornay sauce and a raspberry tiramisu. Hmm? Here, try some of this. It's better. <laughs> that? Well, that's the greatest food I've ever had in my life. What's it called? It's a rare imported delicacy we call lasagna. Here, I have eight more coming out. Oh, 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 oh my goodness. So what do you do for fun? Mm. For fun? I thought so. Come on, I'll show you what the word means. Whee! Let's 
Let's do that again! <laughs> Whee! Oh, harder, Odie! Push me harder! <laughs> You're supposed to watch him every minute! I'm sorry, Mrs. Van Gelt. I shall call the police. Your call is important to us, so stay on Tell them to search everywhere! My precious dumpling can't be alone for one second! Oh, this is wonderful! She never let me watch! Uh, what do you call this again? Television. Oh, she never let me watch television before. What is this wonderful program I'm enjoying so? It's called a deodorant commercial. Oh, I'll have to try that if I ever sweat. I'm going out. See you later, Garfield. Uh, see you later, Odie. Oh. See you later, Prince Orloff. <laughs> Prince Orloff! Ah! That, that woman who owns him is probably frantic. Hello, Liz. Remember that cat they brought into your clinic? Uh, the one on the pillow? He's what, John? At your house? What is Prince Orloff doing at your house? Quick! Huh? Give us the address. <laughs> I'll take you down to Vito's and introduce you to the wonders of pepperoni and mushroom pizza. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm having so much fun, Garfield. I'm never going back to that mansion. <laughs> For some reason, I think you are. Stop him! Bring my widow baby back to me! I'll bet he's going back to the park. Come on, Odie. We can take a shortcut. My baby! Why has my baby run away from me like this? Garfield! Pony! Anybody? I think they're heading for the park. Huh? This is even more fun than watching the odor in commercials. Ah, he's up there! We gotta get him down. Now what are we gonna do? Really we, gotta we gotta get him. Prince Orloff, you come down from that tree right this minute! <laughs> I climbed a tree! Look, look, I, I actually went out on a limb! <laughs> Madam, there's something off about Prince Orloff. He looks different. He does? Something about his face? I, I don't know what it is. <laughs> A smile? Why, why, yes, that's it. He's smiling. I've never seen him smile before. <laughs> Could he possibly be happy? That would be my prescription for your cat, Mrs. Van Gelt. A little less pampering, a little more life. <laughs> oh! 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 Hey, uh, Sergeant, how do we write up a report on this? Yeah, we don't. The chief would never believe it. We were right. He 
is smiling. Oh, my little prince, we have to make sure you get some fun in your life and you don't just sit on a pillow all day. Whee! Well, Garfield, looks like you helped rescue your friend from living in a mansion, being waited on, and never getting to get out and live. Yeah, I bet you'd hate a life like that, wouldn't you, Garfield? I said I bet you'd hate a life like that, wouldn't you, Garfield? I'm thinking it over. <laughs> 